Why don't we just say those four words together? All things are possible. Now, when some of you said those four words, you were thinking, oh, isn't that nice? Oh, I got a warm, fuzzy feeling inside myself right now. All things are possible. Thank you very, very much, Rob. Thank you, Jesus, rather. And, and off you'll go. But I would say that actually a lot of you, when you said that, you're like, oh, geez. Oh, geez. Because if you're honest, what you're thinking is, what a crock. What a crock. All things are possible. No, not all things are possible. <laughs> right? You know, I have been a good person, and God has not been good to me. No, not all things are possible. I have been praying like crazy, and God has not been answering my prayers. No, not all things are possible, Jesus. <laughs> you know, I have been trying, and I've been knocked down, and God didn't show up. No, not all things are possible. Where were you, God, when I needed you most? No, not all things are possible. So sure, this makes a nice little motivational poster for you to stick on your office wall, or this might make a nice inspirational Instagram post for your, for your feed, but, but where does Jesus get off saying, all things are possible? And I have to tell you, I would agree with you 100%. If anybody else had said those words, I would agree with you. I wouldn't believe it. You know, if, if a celebrity tweeted these words out, all things are possible. I wouldn't believe it for a second. If, if a motivational speaker had come in and told us, hey, everybody, all things are possible, I would not believe it. If, if even a founder of one of the world's great religions came up to me and said, Rob, all things are possible, I still wouldn't believe it because I would eventually be able to walk over to their tomb and their grave and look at them in the ground and say, hey, I thought you said all things were possible, and yet here you are. But, you know, if, if any of them had said it, I wouldn't have believed it. But because it was Jesus who said those four words, I actually believe it. And here's why. Because Jesus suffered the, the greatest knockout of all time. And Jesus accomplished the greatest comeback of all time. 